Hello, this is Mac from Southern Blooms Florida Plant Nursery here in Dover. And today we're gonna to talk about fertilization, but taking it back to the basics on starting on how to fertilize and what types of fertilizer to use for your plumeria. But first, please like and subscribe. We're gonna start talking about the basics of fertilizing plumeria. Here at Southern Blooms, when we first start a cutting out, uh, brand new in the pot, we don't use any fertilizer at all. Uh, what we wanna do is we wanna see root growth start and foliage growth to start before you do any kind of fertilizing. So once you see that, what we do here is put a medium analysis of everything, whether it be a triple 12 or a triple 14. And you also wanna make sure that when you do put that on that new cutting, that it is a slow time release. That will keep it from burning the brand new roots um, and causing to stunt the growth of that new cutting. Once the cutting starts to develop and get stronger, you do wanna promote um, some flowering growth, which plumeria are noted for. Uh, so we basically would suggest a, a plant fertilizer that's going to have a high number in phosphorus. What the phosphorus number does, which is the middle number of the three number analysis, helps promote flowering and, um, and the long lasting flower and will also give you abundance of foliage. Um, that happens typically in the summertime. What you don't wanna do is fertilize plumeria when they're dormant um, as you see some behind me, where they have no foliage. Uh, they actually don't need water also because they're not promoting any new growth. You don't wanna do that, especially in the winter time. So basically the, the triple 12 um, or the triple 14, we suggest in the beginning of the spring. And then in the middle of summer, a little bit toward the end, we suggest a higher analysis on the phosphorus side of the fertilizer, which we'll talk about in detail uh, for the beginners that don't know what analysis of fertilizer is. And for those just starting out uh, fertilizing, you'll look and see what's called the analysis on a fertilizer bag, which is typically on the front of the bag. You'll see the number of the first one, um, which is nitrogen, uh, and the nitrogen macronutrient. Then you'll see the phosphorus macronutrient, and then you'll see the potassium macronutrient. So if you're plant label reads like a 13246, uh, which is for heavy blooming, you'll see that labeled in the front. Um, like I said, that's what you wanna use if you wanna try to get the plant to bloom more. Um, the triple 12, 12, 12, or the 14, 14, 14 is for just more vigorous plant root growth and stem growth. Um, and we'll get in a little bit more detail and show you that, what that analysis looks like and later on. 